large deluxe cottage, 20,000 pesos per month, at Virgin Beach Resort is the title of our Virgin Beach Cebu Rog, number 106. Hello everybody, I'm Ron Perry, and along with my wife, Faye Perry, are the owners of Virgin Beach Resort, Malbago, Dan Ventai, and Cebu, Philippines. We're still here in our home in California, but hoping to be at the resort soon. We have a uh, cottage. We have two large deluxe duplex cottages, and each cottage contains two rooms, and each of those are like a studio apartment. And those deluxe cottage apartments are renting for 20,000 pesos per month. So if the US dollar is 50 pesos per dollar, then that's only $400 a month. But right now, of course, the dollar is down, so it's gonna be about 420 to $440 per month. Uh, plus the electrical and the cable TV. The electric, depending on your usage, could be anywhere between 5,000 to 10,000 pesos. That's between 100 and 200 dollars if you use the aircon 24 hours a day and do all your cooking with electricity. Uh, the water, sewage, and trash is included. The cable TV is 1,000 pesos a month. So that's only about 20 dollars. We do have free Wi-Fi. Strong signal in the hotel, but not so strong in the cottages, but uh, strong enough to do emails, that type of thing. But to do uploading, downloading, uh, probably easier to go to the hotel. We do have uh, room service available for our restaurant and bar, and they're open 6 a.m. to midnight. Uh, can have uh, room service anytime if you make arrangements ahead of time during those closed hours. So, just like any apartment, you furnish your own uh, toiletries, toilet paper, uh, everything else, uh, soap and shampoo. Uh, it's completely furnished, it has linens, and you're responsible for washing your own clothes, washing your own linens, or changing the linens, and uh, we'll charge a small fee for that. And also, we do have a laundry service that you can use and uh, we also have a uh, car available with driver if you don't have your own transportation. There's plenty of public transportation available, but for ta staying long term, a lot of people want to get their own motorcycle or car. This is a month to month rental. There is no one year lease contract. So it's completely furnished. There's a private veranda with veranda furniture. There's a Sala set there, and there's a table with four chairs, a room divider, TV with DVD, a refrigerator, and sink. And uh, you can, if you're staying long term, you want, might want to buy your own rice cooker and electric hot plate or a small gas cooker with those new butane tanks that are really easy to refill. They're very cheap. It's air conditioning and Electric fan, there's two double beds, full-size beds. Uh, like I say, it comes with linens. It's up to you to wash your own linens or use our linen service for a small fee. And if you want to clean your own room, that's fine. Otherwise, we can clean it for you for a small fee, housekeeping. Some people do that once a week. Uh, sometimes more, sometimes less. Plenty of storage space in the room divider for your things. And in the CR, we do have a a uh, large walk-in closet before you go into the comfort room. And um, there's a front door and a back door on these cottages so you can have good air circulation if you wanna leave the air con off. There's a cabinet there for more storage and there's lots of closet space there. And in the CR we have a hot water shower. That's electric of course, so the more hot water you use, the higher electric there will be. A lot of people in the tropics, they just take a cold shower. There's a Filipino shower there. Like I say, it comes furnished and there is a roll of toilet paper to start with and you're, it's up to you to buy your own uh, toiletries, more soap and shampoo. So there's a back porch also, and a lot of people do their cooking or barbecuing on their back porch. And we do allow cooking in the room, but we ask the gas cooking be outside. Free use of the swimming pool and other free amenities at the resort. 
there's the electric meter and that's red when you check in and then when you at the end of the month so if you arrive on the first it's the first to the first if you arrive on the second second to the second however you want to do it so there is a uh, free use a lot of the activities some of the things you do have to pay for like the billiards and kayaks and snorkeling and so forth but other those other other things like the obstacle course and playground those are all free there is two double beds so it is good for up to four persons we do have plates and silverware that you can use in your room and of course that belongs to the hotel you don't take that with you if you have your own that's fine or if you want to buy your own that's fine too So we have four of these units for rent. We do have currently one unit being rented out, so we do have the three that are available. And uh, like I say, it's completely furnished, so not much you need to do. As I say, we have 24 hour security. We have a guard uh, daytime and nighttime. So it's completely secure. We do lock the gate at night, and if we know someone's coming back, and of course we uh, remain there at the gate. We have CCTV, so we're able to have better monitoring of all the places of the hotel. We do not have CCTV in the rooms or in the bathrooms or anything like that. There's a privacy issue, and we would never violate those uh, issues. For long-term staying guests, you'd have to test, uh, test negative for COVID, and uh, you have to. Senior citizens would have to get special permission to go out. There's just lots of rules and regulations to follow now with the uh, quarantine still going on in Cebu. There's a refrigerator. Uh, did show a small refrigerator in that one, but. Uh, we do have large refrigerators. The other one was being repaired, I believe. So we do have large refrigerators, not quite full size, but, but large enough apartment size to hold everything for your shopping. Bogo City has the most uh, supermarkets and department stores. I said malls there on one of the <laughs> one of the uh, links there, but it's uh, they don't really have a mall. It's just the the uh, Gasano and uh, Super Metro. Then um, there's plenty of banks and ATMs in Bogo. There's now a few ATMs in Dan Bintai and proper, and that's only 30 minutes away. And also there's some small department stores there. I believe Prince Warehouse there. Uh, public markets at both places. The biggest public market is in Bogo, but a lot of people like the public market in Dan Bintai because the fish there. There's more fresh fish coming there, direct from the uh, fishermen. Thank you for watching. We hope to see you soon.